Hi guys, welcome to my ISO builder. I've just built myself a new Arconlex B extended, which comes in handy right now because there's a question about Qtile. So on arconlexd.com, you'll see that we have um, 25, I think 26 desktops by now, and all is explained on there. And in Qtile, well, let's first have a look, Control T, this is extended, right? So open box is by default your login. Well, I could combine it with the knowledge of a Control Alt E. Control Alt E is Arclix Tweet Tool. And from now on, I am so happy with Qtile. I'm gonna say to the system, never mind all the other beautiful things that we can install and run, but Qtile is gonna be my automatic login. So automatic login to Qtile is what I set to the system. So super X and then reboot, you'll see that it actually boots into Qtile. So the topic of the, the, the question on Discord is, can we change the numbering in Qtile? Now, I'm pretty sure that I've explained that, right? So this, this signs and numbers. Now, Qtile is, oops, sorry, super C. Qtile is written in, let's have a look. What language is Qtile written? It's written in Python, right? And the updates in the past have already broken a few times Qtile because of updates in Python, things are a little bit off. So then we need to sometimes change the code sometimes rebuilds a package so it is part of the ecosystem of Qtile. so pi stands for python and if we open it sublime text is already installed on the system and it's gonna be in here and here you see the qwerty groups the qwerty keyboards and the group labels the only thing you need to change if you wanna don't want these things and these things well these are icons so maybe the best way to show you is actually launch PAMAC and probably gonna browse for for funds or something or TTF and see what's installed because of the fact that we have this these icons here I think it's the TTF awesome or something but actually going via this way is not so interesting best is to do pipe minus r if you can remove it it's probably be installed right so this is what we have and font awesome is in there now there's another guy that you can remember there's also this guy awesome terminal font so one of those or two of those i don't know so we hand picked these icons from the font if you say mm, like it love it keep away otherwise it's line 171 that's gonna show numbers so control save super escape log out and log in should and that's the thing right should actually change the things up there and if it's not it might because of of patches of changes or updates or anything like that but in this case, today, right, it still is working. It's functional. Now, um, oops, I think I made a typo there. Subla. I don't know what I've opened it with then. It says Sublime Text is not installed. I don't know what I used, but um, I'm gonna get my Sublime Text for sure. All right, come on. So what is was installed? I don't know. Q trial, Q trial. I rewatch the video. I don't know. Right mouse click. Ah, uh, probably genie then. Right, sublime text. So 170 something. So we have also the web and the group, and that's nice as well. Super Shift R. Let's not log out, log in, and let's try not working you see super shift r is normally reloading any of our tiling window managers super escape uh, so, uh, super x sorry and then log out let the code apply itself and there you go 
have fun with Q-Time. Cheers.